Okay, let's talk about the defense now. Now the defense's most important job is to protect the front of the net right in the house area, right below the hash mark. So this area right here, that's their most important job. Their second most important job is to be the attacker on any puck below the hash mark. So like hash marks or below, they're the primary attacker. Those are the two things the defense does, okay? The right defense normally attacks those low pucks on the right side of the ice. The left defense would attack pucks on the left side of the ice. While the right defense is attacking the puck on the right side of the ice, the left defense would always be watching the front of the net. So let's watch the video and you'll see exactly how the right defense and left defense should move. Okay, so let's start at the beginning. So we have the right defense, the puck's over here in the corner. What does the right defense do? They move out and they're attacking the player with the puck, okay? You see the left defense protecting the front of the net. As the puck goes high, the right defense has to retreat a little bit to get closer to their house, okay? making sure that they're staying on the defensive side of that player in the corner. So they're retreating a little bit back to the house. The puck goes back down low, and there they are ready to attack again. Okay, and you see the lefty doesn't move, stays right in front of the net. Puck goes low, that right defense again has to retreat back to the house. Okay, as the puck swings to the other side, now the right D is back in position in front of the net, and the lefty is now free to attack the puck. As the puck comes up the boards, the lefty, because it's hash marks are below, is going to attack. The right D is going to protect the front of the net. As the puck goes high, the lefty doesn't chase high. They retreat right back towards the house. The puck swings. Now both defensemen are protecting the front of the net perfectly. Puck swings low again, and there's the right D attacking again. Nice and simple, okay? The main thing, like I said, is always make sure we're protecting the front of the net first. When the front of the net is protected by one person, the second person is free to attack, always staying below the hash mark. So let's watch it one more time, the full video. can see puck goes low retreat to the house attack because the front of the net is covered retreat to the house and attack because the front of the net is covered and there you go that's how the defense should be moving in our defensive zone coverage stay tuned for our combined video where you can see how everybody moves together